King Charles may delay the late Queen's biography due to difficult aspects of his relationship with his mother, including tension over Diana and Camilla and controversy over Prince Andrew, a royal insider claims. Royal historians say the biography may not be published in Charles' lifetime. Royal insiders believe the king may delay Queen Elizabeth II's biography over her relationship with Diana, her alleged disgust with Camilla and the controversy over Prince Andrew. Welcome to Royal Pancakes. Please don't forget to subscribe and click the notifications bell, so you don't miss any updates about the British royal family. Royal historian Robert Lacey said he questions whether the biography would have been published during King Charles' lifetime because it would have had to explore the difficult aspects of his relationship with his mother. Other reasons for the possible delay could be the sensitive topics it will cover, such as the Prince Andrew and Jeffrey Epstein scandal, and the turbulent departure of the Duke and Duchess of Sussex. Charles will have the final say on the choice of biographer, who will have the task of writing about the extraordinary life of the late Queen. Some predict that a female royal biographer could be chosen for the first time, with historian Jane Ridley emerging as a potential frontrunner. The successful candidate is expected to have access to a range of private documents, letters and journals. The late Queen is known for keeping a diary in which she reportedly wrote for 15 minutes every evening. Royal insiders speculate the King could postpone Queen Elizabeth II's biography. There is a statement from a private secretary that the Queen told Charles she wanted nothing to do with Camilla. The biographer must balance the sensitivities of the royal family and their professional reputation among academics and historians. Mr. Lacey told The Telegraph, the years of real crisis during the Queen's reign revolved around the breakdown of Charles's marriage to Diana. There is the testimony of a private secretary who told King Charles who did not want anything to do with Camilla, and who described her as that bad woman, and that Prince Charles himself was almost tears for this. Other sensitive arguments that will be difficult to expand for the biographer are the involvement of the Windsor Duke in the sexual preferences of the Nazis and Lord Mountbats. Andrew Loney, the royal biographer, said, Traditionally the official lives went to an affirmed historian who includes the limits in which he has always been a him, he must work. I suspect that the surveys, although entirely with which it is a mystery, will be taken and there is a good probability that a real biographer be chosen for the first time, especially for Queen Elizabeth LL. In addition to Jane Ridley, other possible historians who could get the best job are Simon Sebag Montefiore, Lord Roberts of Belgravia, and Sir David Canadine. The task of presenting a list to the King will now fall on Sir Clive Alderton, his private secretary and guardian of the Royal Archives. The archives of British monarch Queen Elizabeth II who lived from 1926 to 2022 is placed in the centre, with the members of the royal family, from the left, the couple Prince Andrew, Duke of York, and Sarah Ferguson, Duchess of York, the Queen, the Prince's couple Charles and the future Charles III behind the Queen and Princess Diana Van Wales in red.